G'day guys, welcome back to another episode. I've got one of the most exciting episodes coming up for you guys. Today, I'm gonna go do a catch and cook, hopefully, in this little helicopter, hey. I got Justin here from Coral Coast Helicopter Services. It's gonna be remote, it's gonna be sick, and see if we can get some grub and cook it up. There's not much wind at the moment. It's a beautiful day, and I ain't never done anything like this, so we're gonna get into it and go. <laughs> this is the shit. This is the good stuff right here. What are they called, those? ELT, PLBs. The ELT, PLBs. If anything does go wrong, we're fully sorted, we're fully safe. Um, but fingers crossed that doesn't happen. We're gonna start this little puppy up and start steaming out there. Are you kidding me? Look at this. This is honestly one of the best things I've ever done in my life. No one around for miles and miles and miles. Such a beautiful day. We're gonna go see if we can get a crayfish. This is like, this is my dream. This is like my dream. <laughs> Grabbed all the gear out of the chopper. Couldn't fit too much in this little one. Need the uh, big one to fit all the long fins and the guns in. I got me little mini fluoro green fins that I borrowed from Justin. Gloves of a mask. And that'll get me, let me get me out there and hopefully we can get something. This is honestly so beautiful, hey. I feel like not many people have got the chance to step where we've stepped or swim out and do what we've done. There's a good sign right there. A bit of a crayfish shell. They molt their, molt their outer shell every, every season and go marching. Here we go. Just gonna hop in the drink. Wish us luck. This is the shit that I live for. Only got the ride to the middle of nowhere. We're gonna cry! Woo! Woo! Just to be in the middle of nowhere, out in the elements grabbing crayfish for lunch like that. 
there were so many. Hundreds, hundreds of crayfish tucked away in every crevice. Big baldies, big spangos. This place is a dream, hey. It's a bloody dream. Breeze took one each. Can't stop smiling. We didn't know they put these. Oh, under the seat? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, look at this, eh? How good is this? Straight in the drink, couple of big red crays. We're just going to chuck them in the chopper. Um, head a little bit further down the coast and uh, landed the chopper. <laughs> Don't say that every day. I'm so stoked, man. It's been so much fun. The uh, Western Rock Lobster, they are probably the most delicious uh, crayfish to eat, in my opinion. Pack my stuff back in the chopper. I'm going to take off and keep moving. Who knows what's going to happen, eh? I don't know what's going to happen. So what happened is we just flew over a bit of ground. Uh, Justin hasn't been here yet before. And we sort of hovered over and noticed a few cracks and crevices and we're gonna get in the drink again and just scout this ground. We don't really need any more craze, but um, see if we can find some more honey holes. I've never, ever, ever found ground like that before. Literally just wah, going in sideways and shit like that. <laughs> can't really get into this by boat because those breakers out there locking you sort of in if you wanted to you could swim over the reef probably get pumped or you could fly a helicopter it works looks like a big termite nest it's just absolutely insane all holes in it and stuff like that this is just so cool for me, personally. Let's get in there. <laughs> it's a jacuzzi. Oh, here comes a better one. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, the rappers, boy. Oh. <laughs> Everywhere. I say more. Holy shit! <laughs> Two jumbo in that hole. Yeah, I seen another one when I got washed back as well. <laughs> Just 
monster craze just walking around. It's so untouched. That was a huge jumbo. We've grabbed two or three now. I don't really need many more, so I just thought I'd let that one go. It was too, too easy just picking it up. That's a beautiful, beautiful spot. I'm so lucky to be in here and doing this. I just want to thank you guys because without you guys, I wouldn't have these opportunities. Justin from Coral Coast Helicopter Service. Let's keep going. It's only, we're not even halfway through the day. Woo! What an amazing spot that was. Can't believe we found that from the chopper. Landed, come down here, grabbed a couple of trays. So sick. These guys are not going to believe it. We just flew the chopper over this area here, right in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of nowhere. And it's the most congregated I've seen of rays anywhere else. The drone up in the air to get a better view.
So we're just looking for the lighter. Um, between us, we don't know if we've got one. And uh, it could be a problem because we want to make a fire to cook those crayfish. But it wouldn't be an episode without me stuffing up and forgetting something. But fingers crossed we can uh, scrounge around and find something. I'm already thinking of making a spark from the... Yeah, I'll just put a bit of lava gas on the <laughs> <laughs> Definitely going to want to put that on a stick, I reckon. No way. No way. We are fire, baby. Are you serious? We just hotwired some fire off the chopper. <laughs> that's just... Oh, that's burning my head. <laughs> oh, that oh, that's better now. Oh. <laughs> Woo! That's how you start a fire in the middle of nowhere when all you have is a helicopter, a bit of ab gas, and a rag. Oh, just about burn my hand. I've looked singed all my hairs. Worth it. Worth it. Man, right here in my element, hey. In the middle of nowhere, we're like literally so far from anywhere. Just picked a random little beach to cook her up on, collect them wood, I'm gonna cook these crazy and we just grab an open fire. Man, this is as good as it gets. And these guys can literally do exactly what I just did. Just gotta heat up Justin. Absolutely beautiful, man. Can't wait to get those on the coals, I'm starving. Look at that guys, the fresh craze we got today. On that fire, on the coals, cooking away. Got the heli in the background. Nice, that one. Look at that. Blaking, man. Man, they're like melts in your mouth. Oh, those reds are so much better tasting than the rest of the crays. I love crayfish, but these reds are as good as you get. Literally, they're as top as you can get. Mate, how good is that? Man, I burnt that one a bit. My bad. You know, that one. <laughs> Got a bit of a flame grill. That's the back anyway, it's chill sort of. Hey, look at that. Love. See how white that meat is. A big thank you to Justin from Coral Coast Helicopter Services for making this happen. Hit him up, he's a good lad. We're just going to smash some grey. Um, watch this storm roll over. Head back a little bit later on. And if anything cool happens, I'll film it. But for now, I'll see you guys very, very soon. You. What a day, man. What a day. That sun's on its way down. We gotta get out of here. We've got a bit of a flight back, back to town. When I got a long drive home, so. start in the morning I was after I was uh, not paying attention I was doing a little bit over the speed limit and the boys in blue have picked me up fair enough fair enough it's doing the wrong thing I mean I got up at like 3 in the morning and uh, I wasn't really paying attention so the boys there have uh, the boys there have picked me up but anyway we'll cop it on the chin get this fine and uh, move on that's my first speeding ticket in man like a long 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 time but hey it's all good it's all good the boys are just doing their job can't really hate them for it <laughs>